Hi, my name's Martin and I'm from dwpcorruption.co.uk, uh, the independent watchdog for the Department for Works and Pensions. Today we're in Colmore Row, uh, speaking to various people including taxi drivers and uh, different people from walks of life to get an understanding of what common purpose is. The people that we're speaking to now have an understanding of what common purpose is and the fact that Julia Middleton brought it into the country in, 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 in the early 80s and it's basically uh, a way of to lead beyond authority. We know that Rag & Co solicitors and Evershed solicitors and various solicitors within the Birmingham area are all part of common purpose that house the graduates that are taught and now led by common purpose in a corrupt way. We know that Zurich Insurance, who are the insurance company behind Rag & Co, are also a part of that common purpose. What we don't know is the effects that it has with the judicial system, the police, the MPs and the general corruption within the country. These guys that I'm speaking to, I can, I can solemnly declare I've never spoken to in my life until this moment in time and have just informed them of the 1974 Credit Consumer Act and their rights to be able to get money back and the personal protection insurance has been a complete racket for many, many years that's based on the government as it is today. Hi mate, how are you doing? Uh, good, good, good to talk to you and I hope that I'll give you some good information. Now that we've explained to you about common purpose and the workings of it, what are your thoughts on that? I know nothing about it before, so obviously I'll think about it and look on the uh, website about it. I don't know much about it, no. Right. Completely but, green. But would you say, would, would, would you say that you'd believe that there was corruption in the government and corruption in the country the way that it's been? There's no doubt about corruption in the government, is there so, yeah. Brilliant. You know. Well listen, I'm going to thank you for your time and uh, when the camera's gone off I'll, I'll give you some more information. 